All right. What? Look at this, Rob. Oh, I'm sorry. So that's our power pole. According to the power companies here, we got one free pole and luckily that's all we needed. There's a power pole right across the road from us. So it's perfect. It was pretty easy just connection here. We'll just string it across and, and then... then over to here. So our power box and grid and everything is on the right hand side of the house there. Oh yeah. But you can tell that the framing is already up for the skirting. Mm -hmm. uh, so they've already leveled the structure. They've already got it secured on its mounts there. Uh, you can see the hurricane straps here too. Hurricane straps. So we've got these hurricane straps here. It's got a metal strap with cable that's anchored down in the ground, and then it's just ratcheted tight. So it makes sure that if there's any hurricane winds or anything like that, this building is staying where it is. Done all the way around. Doesn't look like they have done any of the plumbing yet for the septic or the well, so they still need to get that done. One thing I do want to see is if we can get some sort of gate that we can get underneath here because I wouldn't mind using that as storage for kayaks and stuff. Oh, that's a good idea. Oh, and then our well is here. Capped. Beautiful sunny day, but it is a cold wind. Just zero degrees. We got the gutters installed. And in the spring we're gonna look at putting in some like rain catchment systems just for like our landscaping and just easy access to that kind of water. That's a big one. Yeah. See in the wood pile? Yeah. I went to go chop into that stump and he was just going by that stump. They're like camouflaged over here. Thanks, buddy. Oh, no, don't eat him. <laughs> He's not food. Are we going to make his little winter home? Yeah, he wants under all that brush. Under there, yeah. You up like a burrito. <laughs> We're going out to the property today. So we got both cars. We got to pick up our tires for winter. You excited, Kelly, to go to the property? Building a shed today. Well, I got the shed here. One more piece of the puzzle. Yeah. That is a lot of pallets, honey. It's about five, six hundred dollars worth of wood. Oh my goodness, they look in really good shape too. Uh, some are, yeah. It's already rolling. <laughs> nice sunny day out. There was no snow here on Friday. It must have just rained, or sorry, just snowed yesterday. Friday night and yesterday. The ground is even frozen here. Oh, but you can really see where the water has settled. Yeah, it's come forward, eh? Yeah. That's what I'm thinking. We could create either a pond. I think the pond would have to be over on that side. Yeah. 
because a lot of this drainage water is coming from the next property. Mm -hmm. And then we just have to the driveway around it. And then that would hold a lot of this water and keep it out of here. Hopefully. And eventually I'd like to have a proper soil that will actually absorb most of that water and then it won't pool. Mm -hmm. It'll actually be going into the absorbing into the ground like a sponge. Mm -hmm. Over here looks pretty dry though. I think that's where we're going to put the gardens. So this side there's no, there's no retained water. This would be the garden spot. Clear out a ton of trees. Most of them are pretty small. There's a few good sized ones. It's birch or aspen, I'm not sure which. That way. And the back one, I'm going that way. The stairwell. Yeah, it makes sense. It's like, oh, okay, that's not the way we were building. And I was like, yes, this is the way I want to build. So they're building off the front so here. Now, the, he said he just has to switch around some wood a little bit. It's not that big of a deal. Okay. But yeah, now they're going to build off coming off the front going forward. Oh, good. And on the back side, they'll be going, they'll be facing west. Towards the road. Yeah. Or driveway, I guess. Well, that's good. So the path will come down and then down into the gardens. And we'll do some landscaping and stuff up here. Some kind of berry bushes and there's our apple tree. By 14 metal shed. There's a picture of it. Hopefully we can build it and look like that.
I've almost got the deck finished. I think it's more of like an entryway landing deck. It's not very big. But it looks good. Got some snow. What do you think, honey? It's too much snow right now. But sure is peaceful. The silence, it's, it's extremely silent right now. <laughs> Until your phone goes off. Until Godzilla appears. Callie's happy. The time has come. It's a sad, sad day. But also a very joyous day. <laughs> Hi, girl. Oh, they got the the deck almost completely finished. Hi, you're so excited. Looks nice. You know there are stairs. <laughs> color. <laughs> <laughs> Camouflage. <Yeah. laughs> He's a little skittish. Okay. Well, he's like 400 plus pounds. Yeah. So he's got a right to be. Oh. oh, he's huge. Like. <laughs> yes, Kevin. No. <laughs> I wasn't talking about that. But yeah, that's huge too. He followed this way. Hi, but big guy. You're massive. <laughs> oh, look at all the chickens and the duck. And now we're back here. We're going to finish the shed. 